What up, what up, what up? It's Mr. Bass, and I've got the Hendrix Fishing Pond Hopper box. Okay, this month's box has seven items in it. Retail value, $45.71. Looks like a pretty good value. You've probably heard of Hendrix Fishing, and what they do is they go out and try to find local small tackle companies and American-made companies, and those are the products that they put in their pond hopper box. So if you want to support local small companies, this is the box to get. They also have some of their own baits. Hendrix Fishing does uh, a lot of their own baits now, and this is a really good one. This is their number one selling bait. It's called the Predator, and this is Red Flake. This is a very smelly, very stinky flipping and pitching bait, as you can see. It's kind of beefy, but it's very narrow. It's got these tentacles, and uh, of course you could free rig this. You can Texas rig it. You can punch it. You can flip it. You could put it on the back of a jig. It would have to be a big beefy jig if you did that. So. Pretty cool bait, the Predator, and uh, this is not my first time seeing or using the Predator. It is a very, very good bait. Now we have some 5-inch finesse worms from Cardoza Lures. This is a 10-pack, and the color is called Shad Green. This is a very natural color. When they say Shad Green, the actual plastic isn't green at all. They've got little green flecks in it. It's completely translucent. You can see all the way through it. So, fall fishing, fishing around shad, busting schools of shad. This might be the deal. Okay, next we've got a swim jig by this company called Stretching Lines. This is a 3 8 ounce swim jig. They call it the Slammer Swim Jig. Look at this crazy color pattern. Hot Cruise is what they call this. It's pretty lifelike. It's got a big weed guard. I don't normally see such a big weed guard on a swim jig. And uh, you can see the hook looks fairly beefy, but it's a pretty compact hook. And it's got two, two little uh, bait keepers on there. Interesting color to say the least. Maybe the smallies would go after this. This is not a color I would normally throw, maybe in super dirty water. Continuing the theme of interesting colors, a 110 jerkbait by Active Catch. Looks like a fairly deep diver. So here it is, white or bone colored on the top, bright orange below. It's very noisy. Looks like it's got decent hooks on it. So that is bone with a little orange. Okay, this is a guy that I really, really like uh, his products. Uh, this is Pig Jigs. This is uh, a Ned Rig, the Ned and Jig. This color is called Cajun Craw, one eighth of an ounce. He makes some really nice stuff. As far as I know, you can only get pig jigs on Instagram at pig jigs 247 is Ned jigs though they're the real deal Cajun craw we got another Hendrix bait here this is their swim bait it's called the whipping swimmer this is the four inch version and this is very chartreuse Okay, the last thing is an inline spinner by a company called Dangle Lures. They call this inline spinner the coal. Three aught hook, three eighths of an ounce. It's uh, I like inline spinners for bass. I really do. I think a lot of they're overlooked. Used to throw them as a kid all the time, and then you become an adult and you think I'm sophisticated. I'm not going to throw inline spinners. I'm telling you what. They still catch bass. So that's what it looks like. It's got a big EWG hook on it, three odd as it said. And it's just a solid silver inline spinner. 
They also give you a few stickers this month, an Active Catch sticker, a Flip and Stick Bait Company sticker. These are actually words here, kind of hard to see. And that's going to do it for the Pond Hopper box. Also, they put a note uh, on the website that their shipping price is going up. I can't remember what the price was. I'll put it on the screen when I find out. Still a pretty good deal. You get over 40 bucks worth of lures. And uh, they're all American made. They're all handmade. That's pretty cool. Please subscribe to the channel if you like this kind of content. I would greatly appreciate it. And it definitely helps the channel. Smash that like button. Until next time, this is Mr. Bass. Happy fishing!